Let's say I want to check what time it is without rearranging my windows. Note that the clock gadget is partially visible on my desktop. In Windows 7, I can peek behind open windows by pointing to the tile at the bottom right of the screen. When I do this, the open windows temporarily become transparent. When I move my mouse pointer away from the tile, the windows return to their normal appearance. This feature is called Arrow Peek. You could also do this by holding down the Windows key and pressing Spacebar. Releasing the Windows key returns the windows to their normal appearance. If I click on the tile, the open windows all minimize. This lets me rearrange the gadgets on my desktop. Clicking the tile again restores the windows. You can also do this by holding down the Windows key and pressing D. Repeat to restore the minimized windows. Another enhancement in Windows 7 is the ability to minimize all open windows except the one you want to work with. Watch what happens when I grab the top of the Documents window and shake it. The other two windows have become minimized. Now I'll shake the Documents window again. The minimized windows are restored. This feature is called Arrow Shake. Holding down the Windows key and pressing the Home key also does this. Repeat to restore the minimized windows. Finally, you can use your keyboard to cycle through open windows in the same way you could using Windows Vista. For example, you can hold down the Alt key and press Tab repeatedly until you find the window you want to work with. Or you can hold down the Alt key and press the Escape key repeatedly to make each open window active. And you can hold down the Windows key and press Tab repeatedly to use Flip 3D. As you have seen from this demonstration, Windows 7 makes it easier than ever to work with multiple document or application windows open on your desktop.